वेलकम टू करियर टेक लर्निंग अ डिजिटल लर्निंग प्लेटफॉर्म फॉर टेक्निकल इंफॉर्मेशन इंट्रोडक्शन टू ऑक्सिलेरी व्यू लेटेस्ट सी व्हाट इज मीन बाय एन ऑक्सिलेरी व्यू नाउ everybody knows that in industry there are some objects which are of irregular surfaces that is which are not parallel to the regular planes of projections it means that they are inclined to the principal planes that is hp or vp we cannot see the true shape of we cannot see the true shape and size of these irregular surfaces in any of these principal views that is front view top view and side view so when it is desirable to show the true shape and size of this intricate surface that is inclined surface it is necessary to set up an additional plane of projection a view of the surface must be projected on this plane which is parallel to the irregular or inclined surface now this imaginary plane is called as an auxiliary plane and the view on this plane is called as an auxiliary view now let us observe this object now here this is the inclined surface that is an intricate or irregular surface now if you observe this inclined surface in the front view we will get true length now when we observe it in the side view in the side view the shape of this surface is radius that is height is low whereas if you observe it in the top view then this length is also low that means we did not get the true shape and size in either the front view or in the side view or in the top view so for that purpose we have to assume a, another plane which is parallel to this inclined surface that is this plane which is a parallel to inclined surface and we have to we have to project this surface this surface shape or projections on this inclined plane assume plane inclined assume plane and this plane is called as auxiliary plane yahan pe inclined surface jo hai uska true shape and size front view side view top view mein nahi milega humko so wo draw karne ke liye we have to assume a plane which is parallel to this inclined surface now that this inclined plane this plane assume plane is called as auxiliary plane and this plane is exactly parallel to this surface and we have to project the view on this inclined surface on this auxiliary plane and yes this view which is drawn on the auxiliary plane is called as auxiliary view remember that this is the view of an inclined surface that is true shape and size of the inclined surface that we have drawn on this plane which is parallel to the inclined surface the plane is called as auxiliary plane and the view on this plane is called as auxiliary view now as defined auxiliary view is the view of the irregular surface or we will say that the view of an inclined surface now this is the diagram given here we have drawn a front view and top view of the object shown here right now we have to draw the auxiliary view that is the view of this inclined surface now for this let us take an axis x1 y1 that is an imaginary plane this is an imaginary plane which is parallel to this inclined surface this x1 y1 is a parallel to inclined surface right what we are doing we are 
drawing the auxiliary view that is the view of this inclined surface so x1 y1 is a parallel to this inclined surface surface which is called as a auxiliary plane this x1 y1 and remaining part is called as a auxiliary plane now let us draw the projections which are exactly parallel to the direction of observer or which are perpendicular to the inclined surface now let us take the reference of either top view or side view which one is available now top view is available if you observe that this inclined surface in the top view is this one that is this rectangle right inclined surface top view may hum observe karte hain so it will be a rectangle right बट बट यहां पे आप ऑब्जर्व कर सकते हो कि द लेंथ ऑफ दिस इज इंक्रीज राइट ये लेंथ बड़ा है एज कंपेयर टू दिस वन यही टॉप व्यू में लेंथ रेड्यूस हो चुका है राइट सो वी हैव टू प्रोड्यूस दिस रेक्टेंगल ऑन द ऑक्सिलेरी व्यू एज इट इज बिकॉज लेंथ यहां से मिल गया हमको नाउ अदर डायमेंशन वी विल टेक इट फ्रॉम द top view right so let us nominic give the nomenclature to the top view that is a b c d right a b c d so inclined surface yahan pe hai wo top view mein kaise dikhta hai rectangle dikhta hai to wo auxiliary view mein bhi top view ka jo shape rahega waise hi dikhega but size will be different so from xy line the distance of point a on this vertical line from xy line on this projection from xy line is this one right so let us measure this distance from this point xy line to point a and xy line to point b which is similar so जैसे ही इस प्रोजेक्शन पे एक्स वाई लाइन से पॉइंट ए मार्क किया है और ये पॉइंट बी मार्क किया है सिमिलर वे ऑन दिस प्रोजेक्शन वी हैव टू मार्क द पॉइंट ए एंड पॉइंट बी विच इज ऑफ द सेम डिस्टेंस एज दिस वन यहां से एक्स वाई से ये जो डिस्टेंस है एक्स वाई से ये डिस्टेंस है एक्स वन वाई वन से सेम डिस्टेंस एक्स वन वाई वन से सेम डिस्टेंस सो वी हैव noted the point a b now same way from b to c and from a to d let us measure this distance that is 50 mm let us mark point a and point d on this projection like this a already mark d is this one b already mark c is this one and let us join these points let us join this point so this is the auxiliary view now here this auxiliary view is the view of this inclined surface yahan pe inclined surface kaise dikhta hai observer yahan se dekh raha hai perpendicular to inclined surface parallel projections direction is is direction pe parallel hum logo ne projections dal diye that is it is exactly perpendicular to this inclined surface to ye jo aapko view dikh raha hai yahan pe n surface this is the n surface and this view is called as auxiliary view so students this is the way or this is the procedure how to draw the auxiliary view yes thank you so much and let us subscribe the channel for more videos Thank you so much